Mm. So, good morning. So, um, I woke up this morning and felt kind of bad. I just was like kind of in a poopy mood. And so I was going to vlog, but I did not because I was having a bad day and I thought I was like, oh, I'm not in a good enough mood to have like a fun, a nice and fun vlog. Oh my God, these bikers need to pay more freaking attention. I'm literally running over. I didn't mean that. But I just went on a very long walk with Carly. It was like it wasn't that long actually. I think we did like six and a half miles, which is actually, that's kind of, that's kind of long. But, um, Carly came over and we, she like got me to get out of bed and go on a walk and like, it felt really good. It really did. And I just wanted to talk now here, um, because yeah, I don't know. It's just like the day started kind of shitty and it, it has turned around and that's good. That's good. And like, it's okay to have a rough day. It's okay to have bad days. And I just talked with Carly. Oh, and I also got a smoothie bowl. It was very yummy. But yeah. <laughs> I was just like, I talked with Carly about it some. And it's just kind of like, basically what I am here to say is that it's so much better to focus on the beautiful things in life and acknowledge what's good instead of dwelling on everything bad and everything that's going wrong. It's a waste of energy and it's, it tears you down and it makes you feel bad. So why would you do that? And yeah, it's, it's hard to not think about some of the hard stuff because it's, it's right in our freaking faces all the time right now and it's hard to get away from. But there's also so much good in this world at the same time. And all we can do is just recognize that good stuff and try to make the bad stuff a little bit better. And that's my two cents for the day. Thank you very much for listening to my TED Talk. Now, I am on my way to drop off all of my things, like I already said, and yeah. Maybe we'll just uh, listen to a little bit of music now. Maybe I'll get copyrighted, maybe I won't, we'll see. What's on the radio? Dude, this literally played earlier. We planted it, blah, blah. Made a crack in the foundation. Baby, I know it's The pup, the puppy is here, and she is so tired. I walked here to eat bandit. Hi, oh, she's so tired. <laughs> okay, I don't have a lot of time because I am running out of storage, so I'm gonna make this quick. But I'm gonna explain what's happening. So I am in the mood for some shenanigans. I'm ready to be a street rat for the night. I've got my adventure pack ready. And I'm going to pick Mary up because she's in the mood for some shenanigans as well. So, uh, we'll see where the night takes us. 
I personally feel as if we will end up. Ah! No! Anyway, I personally feel as if we will end up in the woods. Uh, but I'll let you know. So, cool. Hello, Aubrey. Um, I'm with Mary now. I picked her up. And, um,. We're in Target, so I'll give you the haul when we get in the car, but I just wanted to give you a little update on where we Staying were at. Staying at the essentials. Yeah, just the essentials for our adventuring tonight. We don't know where we're going to go, but I wore my party shoes, my party socks, and my party pants. So, Perfect. I'm very much ready. Yeah. I feel good. <laughs> okay, I'll, 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 I'll check in later. Okay, beautiful. I've deleted some stuff. I had some bad storage issues, but... So, basically what had happened here is that um, I did, in fact, end up without any more storage left on my phone. And, um, yeah, so that clip cut. But basically, uh, we ended up in D.C. And we went to the waterfront and watched these two little ducks have a good time together and party it up and and that was really it that was all that was all um you missed the target haul too but that wasn't too exciting either and what you're looking at right now is um one of mary's favorite photos of herself so yeah i that's all okay cool anyway okay okay bye Alright, so my phone keeps quitting on us, but she seems to be working now. We're at the gas station. It's where it's brought us. Um, I had some atrocious. 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 Absolutely atrocious. Um, oh. Driving home from DC. But we had a great time at bad. the wharf. It was bad. It was bad. But it's okay. We're just recognizing it for what it was. And that was bad. Um, now we're getting some gas, and our adventure is taking us to the woods now. Gas and behind Mary's baby. house. So that's what's happening. And um, yeah, we're gonna make some s'mores, and I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Cool. Ooh, guys. Okay. Thank you. Any words of wisdom? I feel like there's something we could talk about that would make this more interesting. Shit, I can't grab one. Can't Who's this for again? Aubrey. Ah. Uh, Aubrey Born. Do you recall her? Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. She said she loved you, I think. I texted She's her cool. about you, and she was like, oh, Mary, what a yeah, sweet girl. we had fun. I think we were chorus girls together. We were in together. chorus together. Yeah. And wait, wasn't she in my chorus? Mm-hmm not chamber mm -hmm. we were not chamber girls together that's what it was yeah that's really cool all right my gas is done for a little click click so i'll smell you later all right i'm in mary's basement right now i just wanted to show the fit for the night um yeah this is it uh cute i bought these at target while we were at target and i put them on in the parking lot i hate that you can't see my face right now perfect and then i found this in the car so this is today's look and i feel like it's just perfect for adventuring <laughs> that's all i've packed this on my socks there oh. I hope you saw. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> All right, this is my second s'more. My first <laughs> s'more. Immaculate. She cried. I cried. It Wait, is so I good. And this. S'more number two. I think it's gonna be even better. My s'more wasn't as good. My s'more was like the first s'more. It was the trial s'more. Mm -hmm. Fuck. Fuck. I saw that pull. 
I saw that pull. I saw it. Wait, do we have enough chocolate for another s'more? Mm hmm of course. I think, I think you need a second try. Yeah. I need number two. Wait, do we have more grannies? Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ooh. So I'm just gonna eat this marshmallow instead. Yeah, that's a good call. Alright, Would you like two or three chocolates? One, two, two, two. Oh, chocolate. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. That's a good s'more. Mm -hmm. It needs a campfire. Yeah, exactly. Oh, you fire. Mega stuffed. That's all I have to say. Mega well, stuffed. Just it's a buffet. Already? No. Okay. I'm just gonna lick it. Oh, I can't finish my s'more. That's like one bite left. Come on, man. There you go. There you go. Perfect. Look, 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 look. Night mode. Oh, there's really no difference on the screen because I can't see because they're not in the dark. But it, it lights up for night mode. Shout out Shark Watch. Did you use Katie Knoll's um, promo code? Oh my god, I brought you have one. I hate girls with promo codes. Unless you have promo codes, Aubrey, then I love them. <laughs> I don't think she does. At Do least I, I follow her. What? No. <laughs> That'd be cool if I did, though. That's the thing. It's like I hate promo code girls, but like. I if I was code. one. Yeah, if I was one. I think this really is really pretty it. though. Right. Yeah. You would be a good one. She's calling me pretty. Mm hmm Mary. Aubrey, you'd be a good promo go girl pro need help. Promo code girl too because you're pretty. You're the sweetest. Clean up. Ooh. Oh my god, where's your toad? I wonder how he's doing. I have a toad. <laughs> it lives in the crevice outside the door of my house. His name is Toad Wardo. <laughs> Even better. He's handsome. He makes funny little croaking noises. His best friend's name is Frog, and sometimes they eat too many cookies. If you know, you know. Please tell me you read Frog and Toad when you were a kid. I don't think I read Frog and Toad. <gasps> I did read Frog and Toad! Where they ate oh too God. many cookies and they had to learn what willpower meant. Yeah, my favorite cookie book was If You Give a Boss a Cookie Book. We had Frog and Toad books. Or we had Frog and Toad vibes because they don't know how to stop themselves and we don't either. Exactly, yeah. Pretty much. This has been an interesting adventure. Yeah, I was just weird. thinking. It was weird. <clears throat> I don't. I went over an entire things. curb with like her front tires, and then the best part was that <laughs> she reversed to get off the curb, and then when she went around the, over the curb again, she drove over it just the exact same way. Like she reversed for no reason. Uh, yeah, you know what? It was wow. hard. I was really. I don't know. Do I look like my chain? Does it make me look like a frat boy? Do I look like Sammy Sarantis? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, you know what? It doesn't. Uh, you know what it doesn't do for you? I'm gonna mm. tell you what it doesn't do for you. What? It doesn't really make you look hard. Like you're not like. Damn it. Which is unfortunate. But I that think if it was silver. But if it was silver. I think I should invest in a silver. I think chain. you should invest in a silver chain. Vlog squad, should I invest in a silver chain? Because then it would go with my ear. Yeah. My ear. I was with her. Where she got that? At the Renaissance Fair. Actually, this was the one that Brianna bought for me Wait, from the company one? from the Renaissance Fair. It's the one with the bat wings. Oh, it's the one with the bat wings. I thought I lost the one from the Renaissance Fair, but then I cleaned out my backpack. And it turns out that I just haven't looked at that thing in months. That's what I did. So I, um, it was just in my backpack. I, I guess I haven't opened spandex. that thing since like... March 13th. Timer cams. Oh, <gasps> yes. Can I cross my legs? Literally, like, she a said couple sleeping. hours ago, we were like, oh my god, we're so ugly, we can't pose for pictures, we don't know what we're doing. <laughs> really? Shit, look at her go. We would be a really cute gay couple, I'm just waiting. We would. Like, genuinely, uh, looking at this, like... We would be so cute. We would be such a good TikTok gay couple. Should we do it just for publicity? <laughs> I 100% think that's I think good that idea. that's the only way we could get TikTok I, famous. Because I agree. TikTok loves the gays, and we would be such lovable. We would be mm -hmm. such a lovable gay couple. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you. We would. But uh, then the laughs. What happens when they find out that you, you screw boys like whores on tequila? You know what? It'll just be a scandal, and it'll get us even higher. Oh, oh, what time is it? Wait. <laughs> oh, yeah. That means I need to head home. And the adventure's and we've over. I've been vlogging for 12 minutes. This definitely is like mostly bullshit. All right, Lily. It's time Sorry, to let me just. My shoes. Bye. Bye.